All right, so here is something very, very important for you guys to know. Let me just go to settings. Let's go to accounts and backup. Here, all the way down, we have got Samsung Cloud. Let's tap on this. It's connecting to Samsung Cloud. We've got gallery, other synced data. Now, let me tap on this three dot button here on the top right corner. Here we see an option to download my data. I'll tap on this. Now, here is the thing which I want to share with you guys. It says Samsung Cloud is ending syncing with gallery and Samsung Cloud Drive storage for my files. On 5th of October 2021, Samsung Cloud will stop syncing with gallery and you will no longer be able to access Samsung Cloud Drive, which is of course just about three days from now. Then it says you will still be able to download your data here, which means on the phone or at support.samsungcloud.com. This is until 30th of November 2021. After this date, remaining data will be deleted. You heard it right. Samsung is going to delete the data after 30th of November 2021. I'm hoping that you guys are getting the point here. Again, let me tap on this three dot button. Here you see link with OneDrive. When I tap on this, as you can see here, it says you will get 15 GB of storage free for a year. After the move, gallery will be continuously backed up to OneDrive. Everything else you are currently backing up to Samsung Cloud will continue to be backed up there with no storage limit. So Samsung is moving your gallery sync to Microsoft OneDrive and everything else that you sync, like it could be messages or call logs or your phone settings will continue to back up on Samsung Cloud. So all you need to do is you have to make a move to Microsoft OneDrive, especially those of you who have saved some data on gallery. And if you want to continue to save your images and videos from gallery to Samsung Cloud, you will have to make the move to Microsoft OneDrive because there is no more support from Samsung for syncing your gallery data. All right, now what is the action you need to take? If at all you have saved any data on gallery, you can download it right here on the phone. Just tap again on this three dot button. We have download my data option here. Tap on that, just tap on continue. Here, we also get an option to move it to OneDrive. It says we will move all your pictures, videos, and files, and we will keep syncing gallery. You'll get the same amount of storage you currently have in Samsung Cloud free for a year, which should be about 15 GB. Second option is download my data. We will turn off gallery syncing, remove pictures and videos stored in the cloud and remove Samsung Cloud Drive from my files. You will have 60 days to download your data and we will delete it after that. You won't be able to sync gallery to OneDrive until the download period is over. And the last option is to delete my data, which you can also do if you don't want that data to remain there. Now the best thing to do with if at all you want to keep those files on cloud, then you can directly move it to OneDrive right from here without any hassle. And it says this opportunity to move it to OneDrive will expire on 4th of October, which is this month, two days from now. So you will have to hurry if at all you want to move your data from Samsung's Cloud Drive to OneDrive. Just tap on confirm here. It will take you to this page, make the move to Microsoft OneDrive, the same page which we saw before. You will get 15 GB of storage free for a year. Just tap on this and tap on connect. Here you see connect to your Samsung and Microsoft accounts. We can easily sign into Microsoft apps on all your Samsung devices by connecting your accounts. This means once these accounts are connected, we will be able to easily log into Microsoft applications on all the Samsung devices. Just tap on connect here. If you already have a Microsoft account, you can log in here. If you don't have it, create one and continue. These are the steps you need to follow to move to Microsoft. It's already late. We are left with a few days for this transition to happen. So if at all you have synced any data from my files or from Samsung Gallery to Samsung Cloud account, then make sure you download the data and save it on your phone or anywhere else or migrate to OneDrive to save that data as well as to continue syncing your data from Gallery and my files to Microsoft OneDrive. All right, then that's all I wanted to share with you guys. If you find this information useful, make sure to smash the like button. And if you're new on the channel, do subscribe and become a part of Apex community to know more about Samsung Galaxy phones, Android applications, Galaxy watches, and anything related to technology. That's all I want to share here today in this video. Thanks a lot for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. I will see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.